Right, and once again I'm gonna shut up so that you can hear this. Yo son, is everything okay? Don't worry, I'm fine. I want to ask you about that man. Oh, that man. Uh... The man called Landy. What did he talk with my father about? Landy demanded the mirror, and then they threw me out of the dojo. The black suits? Catch the names? I don't know. They came out of nowhere. I see. Thanks, Fukusan. If you remember anything at all, be sure to tell me. Ryo-san, why? What you gonna do? Ryo-san, where are you going? You're not going after them. Please, don't. Look what they did to Hazuki-sensei. They killed my father right in front of me. I will have my revenge. I need to do this for my father. Okay. <laughs> yeah, in case you couldn't tell there, I did actually leave the room there. Uh, someone wanted me again. Uh, yeah, that was pretty much the cutscene that sets the bar for uh, Shenmue. It says in the uh, notebook, I'll get revenge for my father. Ask around to see if anyone saw men wearing black suits that day. Okay, and then comes the uh, one of the main parts of the gameplay. There's three main parts of the gameplay: free roaming, you know, talking to people, looking around, and shit. Uh, if we talk to Fuxan again, you hear Fuxan, some good dial dialogue. What? About those men. If you go after them, take me too. No way. Why not? Oh, gotta press A. I don't want to lose anyone close to me again. Hazuki-sensei took care of me since I was 15 years old. That's 10 years. He was like a father to me. I appreciate your intentions, but you have to understand. But real son Right, it says in the notebook, I can't involve Fuksan. Even though you do involve him, well, kinda. Right, next flashback is when you look up here. Which actually has some symbolic meaning later in the game, by the way. I'll probably point it out anyway when we get to it, but just watch. Right, this is my favourite flashback because it's just, it actually like... Ryu's father, he actually taught me something about life here. When I was that age, right? A friend from school? And what is a friend? Well... A friend is a friend. That's right. Just as a parent is a parent, a friend is nothing other than a friend. But listen, real. Parents often die before their children. Oh. That's the law of nature. Friends will be there for you, even after parents die. So treasure your friends. And friends you can trust are true friends indeed. Oh my god, goosebumps! <laughs> Understood? Okay, yeah, that was like, wow, I love that cutscene. Right, so, let's just get on with the actual game now. Start some gameplay, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, you can do quite a bit in the first day if you know what you're doing. Uh, and I don't think the game means for you to do this much, as much as I'm going to do anyway, on your first day, because, uh, Ah, fuck it, I'm not even going to explain, but we're going to do this much anyway. Yamanose. And Shenmue's kind of as bad as Metal Gear Solid when it comes to cutscenes at every turn, you know what I'm saying? Uh, pretty much everywhere you go you'll initiate a cutscene. 
asking you to do something or making you aware of whatever or advancing in the plot, like right now! And this is a seriously good scene here, so again, I'm gonna shut up. Hey, yeah. Hi, Megumi. You got a kitten in there? You promise not to tell my mommy? Sure. Okay, then I'll show you. Is this your kitten? Uh-uh. But this kitty, see? She's all alone. All alone? These cutscenes make me so happy. The other day, when it rained, a car ran over her mommy. My big sister saw it. She said it was a big black car. A black car. <gasps> and she said it was really scary. Oh crap, I'm being shouted on. I'll let let you guys watch this, be right back. And so now I can be the kitty's mommy. But mommy says we can't keep the kitten at home. So you going to keep her here? Yeah. Everybody's helping out too. Like Kota, Yasuo. And Kaya. I see. Kitty don't look so good. Think she's hungry? Okay, back. Just in time, by the way. <laughs> stupid parents bought me a stupid Wait case a of water. <laughs> okay. Right, here we get to pick what we get to feed. The kitten. Hmm, what will the kids prefer? Dried fish or fried tofu? I wonder. Fried tofu! Fuck no. Yeah, if you give her the fish, Megumi will give you the next bit of information you need to advance for the game, but if you give her the cake and the kitten doesn't eat it, then she won't say a thing, you know? She's so tiny, but already an orphan. It's so sad! Yamagishi-san almost got ran over too! Yamagishi-san? Yeah, the car was going so fast, he got shocked and fell! And hurt his backside, so now he stays home all day. When I go to the candy shop, I always stop by to visit him. Yeah, it's close by there. Megumi, you need to be careful around cars, too. Yes. Well, I've got to go now. But wait! We gotta think of a name for the kitty! Oh, well, when I think of a good one, I'll let you know. Oh, there's so many sound effects in that house right now. Bye-bye, y'all! Bye-bye. Oh god, that was my mom. <laughs> Maybe I should edit that out. <laughs> She's getting in the way of this game's epicness. Right, so we go to visit Yamakashi son. So yeah, every time you walk by here, like, you know, every day, you just come and pay the kitten a visit, you know. Give her some milk in that, let her grow. Now I think if you feed and feed her enough, then you initiate like more cutscenes about the game, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't know if I'll get them, but I'll try. Because I think I might breeze through the game enough. You know, know what I'm saying? Ah, uh, right. And we've stepped into another cutscene here. We are going to help a woman who has Excuse lost her own me? house. Yes. Well, I don't know if it's her house, but still. What's this name, Plate say? It says Tajima. Does it? Does I'm it? trying to find the Yamamoto's house. Seriously, I don't know. I can't read Japanese. But see, my eyesight is bad, so... Don't worry. I'll look for it. Wait for me in that park up ahead. You're so kind. Thank you so much. Uh, I think I take by what I said. Ryo's a good guy. You know? 
He's a good character. He has the time to take care of a kitten and help an old lady out. Know what I'm saying? Right. The first time I played this, I totally didn't know what to do and ended up abandoning the old woman. Okay. What house was it again? It's one of these. She just walked right past it when she, like, went to go sit in that park, by the way. No, that's not it. Oh, fuck. Gone in the wrong direction. Right, this is it then. It will be. Yep. Yamamoto. That's it. Guess I'll go get that lady. <laughs>